In this video, I'm going to show you my top three video editing software programs, especially when it comes to YouTube. I've used all three of these video editing software programs in the past. Uh, these are absolutely 100% free. Uh, so I will leave a link to each one of these in the description box below. I'm not affiliated with these, these companies in any way. I'm not paid by them. Um, so just keep that in mind. These are, these are some of the best free uh, solutions for video editing. So let me just hop on my let me just hop onto my computer real quick so I can show you each of these um, software programs. All right, so one of the best free video editing programs on the market right now is DaVinci Resolve. And this is by far one of the best free video editing programs available to you. Now, you will see a paid option, uh, but there's really no need to worry because they should offer a free option as well. Uh, so I'll probably place a link in the description to this site uh, below so that you can download this software or you can just go ahead and type it into Google. And as you can see here, um, it looks like they must be working on some new free software because this Resolve 14 came out pretty recently. Uh, but as of now, as of sometime in the fall of 2017, I am using the 12.5 version and it works just fine for me. Uh, so once you have this software downloaded, you might be able to figure out a lot of it on your own. Uh, but if you can't, don't worry because there's thousands and thousands of YouTube videos out there to help explain um, how to use the software to get the best possible finished videos. So this is DaVinci Resolve. It's definitely one of my top picks for free video editing software. Um, there's certainly a learning curve to it, but that's okay. And at any time you can choose to get uh, the, the paid option for this. So maybe after a year of using the free resolve, maybe your, your YouTube channel or, or your business starts to take off and you wanna make even better videos than what the free option for DaVinci Resolve offers. Well, then you can just go ahead and get the paid option and you'll already know what, what's going on. You'll know where everything is and you'll, you'll be a much better video editor at that time. Uh, so number two on this list is going to be Windows Movie Maker or iMovie. And you've probably used these programs in the past, but it's important to remember that they probably are, are already on your computer and that they're very simple and straightforward to use. Uh, so if you're just gonna make one or two videos for, for a class or something, or for a wedding or a birthday party, I suggest using Movie Maker or iMovie because there's really almost no learning curve to these programs, especially when in comparison to something like Adobe Premiere Pro, which I've been using for years, uh, but there's still, still so much about the program that I, I'm just completely unaware of. There's no way I'm gonna be able to learn every single little thing in Premiere Pro. Um, and that's what's great about Movie Maker or iMovie because you can just turn on your computer, open up one of these programs, throw some video clips in there, sort of mash them together and literally be done within 15 minutes. You can be done with your video on something like Movie Maker or iMovie. Uh, so you probably already have one of these on your computer, but if you don't, just go ahead onto the Windows or Apple Store and just go and download it for free. All right, so the number one free video editor on the market right now is Shotcut. And here's their website. It almost looks like something straight out of 2006 or something, but don't be fooled by the website because once you download the software, you'll realize what Shotcut is really capable of doing. And that is providing a wonderful free service um, for video editing. And that sure, maybe it might have a couple of limitations when compared to something like Adobe Premiere Pro or Final Cut Pro. But when you're getting a free product like this one, you just can't pass it down. Uh, there's certainly a learning curve to this as well. Uh, but once you get the basics, you'll be able to publish videos in 4K with amazing quality for absolutely free. Uh, so don't forget, I'll leave a link to all three of these software programs in the description box below. Uh, one other thing I wanna note is that if, if you're planning on downloading Shotcut, just be careful on their website because there, there will be some banners um, that will sort of be clickbait and they'll be advertisements just make sure you don't click on those make sure you actually click on this link right here this this is going to be the one that you want if, if you if, if you accidentally click on this advertisement uh, you might end up downloading something that you really don't want to download uh, some type of virus or something but as long as you click on this link you should be perfectly okay you can read other reviews online um, shotcut is definitely a legitimate uh, service just make sure you get the right link i don't know why they have those ads on there that take you to some other website to try to make you download something else. So just make sure you're doing it the right way. Um, and this video is, is, is certainly not sponsored by anyone. I have no affiliation with these companies that I mentioned in this video. Uh, these are simply my top free programs 
And in case you're wondering, I actually use Adobe Premiere Pro for my videos uh, simply because it gives me so many more options to create high quality videos. And that is a paid option. I pay $20 a month for Adobe Premiere Pro, but it's worth it for me. So you just have to decide whether or not you want to get a free video editing software or if, if you want to pay $19.99 per month and get something like Adobe Premiere Pro. So if you have any questions about video editing software, just leave them down below in the comment section and I'll try my best to, to respond to you as quickly as possible. Uh, thanks so much for watching and I will see you next time.